It won't endanger anything. It won't transform anything among you and your mom. And I saw firsthand. I didn't actually have my father full-time into my life until I was 16. For a really long time, Harvey's family has been all the rage with everybody laying out an all-around flawless picture of their faultless lives from the external. It seems like Steve and Marjorie are a caring couple with fruitful vocations and respectful kids. Yet the fact of the matter is very unique as of late murmurs have begun coursing that Steve Harvey, the family's patriarch, isn't the man we as a whole suspected. He was clearly his own child, Broderick Harvey, is prepared to uncover and stand up to him. For being a self-centered father, it's difficult to envision the magnetic Steve, known for his appeal in mind, on TV being blamed for something like this. So after all Steve consumed practically the entirety of his time on Earth, making this picture he has on screen, showing that he has his life set up however, it is far more chaotic than an individual might envision so back to the start of Steve Harvey's excursion, before he turned into the prestigious figure. We know today his Hollywood distinction and achievement Steve's life followed an alternate way through and through incidentally. His ascent to fame wasn't generally a smooth ride during the 80s. Steve Harvey was only a conventional protection sales rep. During this time, he was hitched to his most memorable spouse, Marsha and they invited twin young ladies named Carly and Licker in August 1982. Later Broderick was brought into the world in 1991. Much to anyone's dismay that this apparently conventional family would before long leave on a turbulent excursion. As destiny would have it, Steve's life went off in a strange direction when he took a shot at stand-up satire. Shockingly, he won a pitiful $1.50 award for his comedic ability. Yet that little triumph lighted a flash inside him, powered by the craving to seek after his newly discovered enthusiasm. Steve pursued a trying choice to leave his place of employment as a protection sales rep and left on an unsafe way in the parody world anyway. This profession shift accompanied its own arrangement of difficulties and Steve's relationship with Marcia endured, thus the strain at last prompted their separation in 1994. In the years that followed, Steve confronted various individual and expert challenges. And sadly, this wild period likewise negatively affected his relationship with his youngsters, as a dad Steve frequently wound up missing from their lives because of his constant quest for vocation achievement. We as a whole realize Steve Harvey is a notable name in media outlets. With a profession crossing many years, he has facilitated different programs, wrote a few books, and surprisingly, took a shot at acting anyway. It was on his show, Steve, where he uncovered a profoundly private and close to home second from his life. He talked about his child, Broderick, and how they stressed his relationship for a long time Steve talked sincerely about how he was just 25 when he chose not to reside with Broderick and what that choice meant for their relationship for quite a while Broderick spent a huge part of his existence without his dad. And when Steve moved to Atlanta, Broderick was reluctant to move in with his dad. He would have rather not harmed his mom. And yet he felt areas of strength for a to interface with his dad in the most natural sounding way for him, Broderick said. I really want that association with him, Steve. It was a hard choice for him to make, yet he at last chose to make the stride and move in with his dad anyway. His mom, Marsha Harvey, was so certain about his choice, which added to the circumstances' intricacy. Regardless of this, Broderick realized that he expected to reconnect with his dad, and he took that risk, quick sending to May 2019. Broderick revealed an association with Steve on one of his television shows, saying I didn't actually have my father full-time in my life until I was 16. Furthermore, as a reaction, Steve said I had consumed my whole time on Earth, attempting to compensate for the missteps I made as a young fellow actually a lot further, and what Steve's children have had to deal with it won't risk anything, it won't transform anything among you and your mom, and I saw firsthand. I didn't actually have my father full-time into my life until I was 16. 
All right, they were moving to Atlanta, and they said, Hello, Broderick, believe that you should move with us, since we truly need to unite his family now to me. I've been living in Cleveland my entire daily routine. I've been experiencing with my mother. It's been me and my mother that is all there is to it in my subconscious I'm similar to know. It will hurt my mother except for at 16. I knew that is what I really wanted as a man. I really wanted that association with him, right not terrible, but not great either. I 100 reserve you going to start up that discussion and it won't transform anything among you. And her mom for sure the time has elapsed and Broderick, the once disregarded child of Steve Harvey, has developed into his own individual, cutting out a name for himself in the business. In spite of the hardships he looked during his childhood, Broderick has figured out how to prevail with regards to demonstrating and past not satisfied with simply being perceived for his striking looks, Broderick dug into the domain of business, displaying his imaginative vision. By sending off his own dress line, Neat Cash, not Companions Nymph this adventure, has permitted him to communicate his one-of-a-kind style and creative sensibilities, while resounding with a different crowd, looking for snappy streetwear Broderick's devotion and enthusiasm for his image, have been obvious as he has developed a reliable following and grabbed the eye of compelling figures inside the design business in spite of Broderick's achievements and development, the effect of Steve's past carelessness can't be eradicated. The long periods of feeling dismissed and deserted by his dad have likely left profound, close-to-home scars, molding Broderick's viewpoint and strength an insider currently uncovered that there is huge pressure fermenting among the kin because of this mixed family framework with one specific wellspring of conflict being Lori Harvey who has earned significant popularity and respect. Contrasted with Steve's different kids, the focus on Lori appears to have caused disdain and desire among the kin, making a gap inside the family Eve Harvey. Wedded his ebb and flow spouse, he promised to cherish and treasure her and embrace her kids as his own anyway. The imagined good relational peculiarity appears to have neglected to emerge, rather than a unified and cherishing security. Apparently, Steve's natural youngsters, including Broderick, have been denied of the paternal love and consideration that their stepkin get this undeniable unique treatment for his stepchildren, has energized a developing feeling of frustration and disregard among Steve's own children. A circumstance brings up issues about reasonableness and value inside the family as Steve's commitment to his stepchildren apparently eclipses his obligations towards his own tissue. An insider told Radar he made the best decision taking on Marjorie's children and loves them like his own, yet there's a ton of discord among the mixed Harvey group. The source educated Radar, the most recent tattle concerning Steve Harvey, has sent shockwaves through the diversion world, while many saw him as a legend for embracing Marjorie's kids. The story appears to go in a new direction in secret, as opposed to treating every one of the kids. Similarly, Steve has supposedly been showering commendation on his stepchildren, while disregarding his own organic children, making them experience both in their high school years. And in the current, this treatment has left an unpleasant desire for the mouths of Steve's organic kids who have been compelled to take a secondary lounge while their step can relax in their dad's approval. Likewise, an overwhelming blow for those had expected a cherishing and steady relationship with their dad. The aggravation Steve's natural kids got through is unfathomable as they not just needed to persevere through their teen years without their dad's direction, yet are presently passed on to adapt to the continuous repercussions of his disregard. Tattle has it that around the time Broderick Steve's child was conceived the magnetic host purportedly met Marjorie in one of his clubs. Yet their things took a turn, it appears to be, that Steve was conning not just on his then wife Marcia with Marjorie, yet additionally, with one more lady he experienced at a restorative counter by the name of Mary Lee supposedly. When circumstances didn't pan out with Marjorie around then, Steve burned through no time in separating from Marcia and venturing out with Mary as per Steve Gizunian. With Marcia self-destructed, 
In light of the fact that he was too centered around his profession, strangely, this opinion was reverberated by liquor and Carly, his twin girls, further powering the story that Steve's desires eclipsed his obligation to his family. While addressing individuals, Steve said that Kodnick stood up to him about the unfairness he has done to her. But at this point, the twins are considerably more full-grown to comprehend. And pardon their dad, he says, that years after the fact they told me, Father, we didn't have the foggiest idea about why you left us, yet we know now you needed to go. You didn't have a place with us. You have a place.